Hey guys, so today is Sunday, March 23rd, 2014, and I just wanted to do kind of a little update ramble video. Nothing too specific on the agenda, but I picked up a few things today, and it's a beautiful day, and I'm in a good mood, so I wanted to share that. So a couple of things, um, a, a few people have asked me what I drink in my water. So this is a product that I've been using since before surgery, so a couple of years now, called True Lemon, and I've talked about it on my channel before, but um, they're just little packets of, um, let's see, crystallized lemon. I almost said freeze dried, but I knew freeze dried wasn't the right word. So they come in these little packets, and it says, um, Cold pressed and crystallized lemon, one packet equals one wedge. Now these are pretty potent, they're not sweetened at all. So for this much water, I would use a half a packet because I don't like it overly lemony, lemony but you could certainly add more. And then also, I just picked these up yesterday and I really like them. Same brand, um, True Lime, this is Black Cherry Limeade. Now this one does have some sweetener, I believe it has stevia. And let's double check though. Yeah, stevia leaf extract is the sweetener, and but it's not overly sweet, which I like. Comes in packets like this. And um, again, for that size, I used a half, half a packet, and it just was a little bit of flavor, and it didn't turn the water like bright red, so you know there's not a whole lot of extra dyes in there, which makes me feel good. Um, also, I got a shirt. <clears throat> I've not tried this on yet from Ross. So blue is out of my comfort zone. And uh, so we'll see, you know, back's just plain. We'll see how it looks. Um, I'm hoping the blue will look nice with my blonde hair. Um, I just have never been much of a blue person. So we'll see how it looks and I'm sure you will see it in an upcoming video. Uh, the other thing that I got, so I am a big body shop fan, and I think you guys know that, but they are having a sale, buy three, get three free, and that's when I really try to stock up. And so they were having that sale today. They also have a point system, so I had four points, which means I had $15 worth of store credit. So I decided to go shop. So the six items I got, I bought another of the vitamin E gentle face wash, face wash. And I've been using this now for, I wanna say three or four weeks um, with their vitamin E line. And I think it's made a huge difference, difference in my skin. Um, the routine I use is the cleanser, then the toner. I have an acne, uh, topical acne medication that I put on. Then I put on a moisturizer. And then in the mornings before my foundation, I'll put a primer on and then my foundation. So it seems like a lot of steps, but it's making a difference and it, and it feels like I'm just, my face is cleaner. So I really like that. So I've been really liking this um, cleanser. And then this is a new product for me. It's the Seaweed Purifying Facial Cleanser and it's an exfoliator. So this is, um, I, I really like the smell of uh, this cleanser, um, this the seaweed. So the moisturizer that I use in the mornings is um, the same seaweed, which I expected to smell nasty, but it actually smells really good. Um, then the other thing that I got that I buy consistently, so I stocked up, these are body room and linen sprays. So there's mandarin and tangelo, and then pomegranate and raspberry. And I combine the two. I just spray one, spray the other, and the combination of the both I feel like smells really good. And so I went ahead and bought four bottles. And I have two bottles in my bedroom that have about this much left in each, so I decided to stock up. So my total for these six items was $32. Now, these alone, um, this by itself is 17 these are normally 12, this was I think 15, something like that. So um, then using my, um, my points, so my $15 worth of store credit, um, took, it, I did the math on my calculator, it's something like $3 and something a piece per item, which 
you can never beat that. Like I can't imagine getting a better deal on these items. So I'm really happy about that. And yeah, this morning I went to um, OA this, this morning at nine and that was good. And then I went to the bookstore for a little while. I just finished reading, read three, four now. Um, Philippa Gregory is an author and she wrote The White Queen, which I started reading because there's a show on stars called The White Queen and I really love the show. So I started reading the books. So I read The White Queen. Then I read uh, The Red Queen uh, and then, which I didn't enjoy The Red Queen as much because I don't like that character as much. But, uh, and then I wrote, uh, read Lady of the Rivers, which is about the White Queen's mom and her history. And then I just finished yesterday reading The White Princess, which is about the White Queen's daughter. And then her reign as queen. So it's historical fiction, but I just really enjoy it. And so at the bookstore today, I was looking through some history books about uh, the Tudor line and um, kings and queens of England. and. I, I like history anyway, so uh, it was fun to kind of look at that and put pieces together. I haven't decided what book I'm going to read next of Philippa Gregory's. I'd like to finish The Red Queen and then pick the next one, so we'll see. Um, what else? So I had, so 18 months ago now, um, I had a large mass um, in my abdomen. For those of you who don't know, large. Um, it was the size of a basketball, which because I was so heavy, none of us knew it was even there and it had two liters of fluid in it. So that's been removed, thankfully, and it was not cancer, thankfully. And, um, but I was, and it was connected to my ovary and fallopian tube on the left side. So I was very worried that uh, one was growing on the right side and it's been kind of on my mind. And so I got an ultrasound uh, on Friday and there's no signs of any cysts, which makes me feel great. And I'm so happy about that. It was a huge worry for me that I don't even think I expressed um, to myself really. It just, until, until it was over and then it was kind of like settled in that I'm okay. So that feels really great. It's great news. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to think of what else. Um, I've now lost 196 pounds, so I'm almost to that 200 mark. I haven't decided yet what I'm gonna do. I, I'm really leaning towards buying a ring, like for myself, like a nice ring, not like huge diamonds or anything, but um, just something I can wear that'll remind me of um, my journey and how important recovery from this eating disorder is and uh, to keep going. So um, I'm trying to think of what else I can tell you about. I made chili yesterday, which I've made a video for and um, in the past, not yesterday. <laughs> so check out my other videos and you'll see a link for that. Um, I'm still pondering in my mind different videos and different ideas that I have and things that I want to do. Um, those ideas are still percolating, and uh, but I haven't forgot about you guys. I'm just keeping on, keeping on. Um, so yeah, life is good and things are going good. I don't know what else to say. Um, so I'm going to leave it at that. Please know more videos are coming. I've got a list of things that I want to do. And uh, yeah, I appreciate all of you guys and all of your support. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.